looking at the Eagle Deluxe Shooters bag today. That with a broken shell extractor pretty much will get me through most emergencies of a class like that, a lot of them. And in here I keep a little uh, lens cleaning cloth that pops out so I use this pretty frequently to clean my Oakleys at a, in a class or something, wipe them off and stuff off that. Ignore my optics on my gun, but I usually don't pamper my endpoints too much. This just folds right up. Sticks right in there. So it's pretty handy to get to and I don't have to worry about where it is. Uh, That's where I keep my sword ins, my ear pro that I'm always, I wear. I Hundreds and hundreds of hours of these, these ear pro and they're the most comfortable thing I've ever worn. They've got the padded uh, gel inserts for ear pieces, so this is very, very comfortable on the head. It's a good seal even with your glasses in here. Um, just super comfortable and super reliable and durable. I, I think I'm on maybe my second pair of batteries in about four years. I wear them all the time. They're just awesome, awesome pieces. So, there. And that pocket I pretty much leave reserved for my sword ends there. They just drop right in there. This pocket, it's got a triple mag pouch. Also, these are all Velcroed in so you can adjust it and move these, these pockets around anywhere you want to. Um, I know we're a little long-winded here and talking about everything, but just wanted to show you all the really neat features on this Eagle Deluxe Shooter's bag. Um, I have keep in here, I've got four uh, Glock 23 pistol mags that's the pistol I run the most so I keep eight of those I'm sorry I've got eight of them in here there is also this triple mag pouch here but I don't even use that I just keep eight mags in there this next little compartment here I keep a bottle of slip 2000 EWL lube just in a plastic bag for obvious reasons a uh, paint pen for marking mags or making adjustments on my sighting tools uh, got a uh, lens pen which I can wipe off my dust off my optics with that side and then it's got a little uh, tip here that I can wipe off any oils or anything with that really neat thing to have range just got a pin in there it's a sharpie for marking targets, marking anything, another pin as you can see I duplicate some gear that I use all the time oh, there's a piece of brass put that in the brass boat. a little Another thing, a lube, a Glock tool, pretty useful to have. Another bullet, another battery. Just a couple odds and ends in there. Keep uh, those AAA batteries handy right there for accessing for my sword ends if my battery starts to go. If I get the low battery indicator, I can right away change it. So that's what makes up that pouch. Uh, this is pretty much set for just a normal day at the range, so I got some 38 that I carry around for running through my little backup gun, my little J-frame. Um, keep got a box of 40 ammo in here that I was shooting out of today. That sits in there. I've got five Glock 22 magazines uh, with my orange floor plates, just my range mags that designates that. Pretty much live in my range bag all the time for running my Glock 35 or running in my 23 also. Uh, I've got a beta mag loader that I've loaded tens of thousands of rounds of 223 into mags with this. Um, awesome little tool, just slips right over a, an AR mag. You lift it up, drop five rounds in, push it down, loads five rounds for you. Awesome tool to have. It's used all the time. And I've also got my uh, Butler Creek Up Lula loader with pistol mags. Slips right over a 1911 mag or a Glock mag. Those are platforms we shoot the most. Um, just drop a bullet in, lift it up. Very awesome, easy to use. It locks like that. And I've also got an Eagle dump bag that I wear if I'm doing a lot of pistol shooting. I'll throw this Eagle dump pouch on. This just mounts on your belt. Just Velcros around your belt. Um, usually just wear it uh, behind at about 5 o'clock or so. All I can do, it, it just doesn't take up a lot of space on the belt like that. But if I want to access it when I'm using it, I just open this up and now I've got a little dump bag for pistol mags or rifle mags or whatever I'm running. Mostly, or yeah, exactly, I throw a bottle of uh, water or whatever I need right in that bag and I've got it on my person if I'm going to be away from my range bag or my 
my water for a while. So you can adjust the tension with this little uh, buckle. It's got shock cord if you want it to just be easy to access, you don't want, or you know, harder to access, you don't want things to fall out. You can adjust it that way. And then also, in, even if you have it hanging there getting stuff, you can just flip this little flap and that'll keep it closed and pretty much keep your contents in there until you need them. So, neat little little bag to have. I use one all the time. So always keep one handy. These are only about 20 bucks. For, I mean, one of the best 20 bucks I've ever spent. I own quite a few of these. I use them all the time it's for different things. Keep one like on my hiking pack, um, on the strap all the time in case I find cool rocks or something to pick up or if I need to throw a little extra water or throw a sandwich or something and I don't want to get it in my bag or if I keep a couple of uh, stuff like that I can keep in there. And we're almost through with that. I guess I can put these back later. Then in this side I've got, there's another little pocket here. I don't have anything in there right now. Usually keep a few mags, stuff like that in here that changes depending on my range trip. Right now I've got a couple of uh, AR mags in here. And then I've got my uh, ATS uh, suppressor pouch with my Surefire can in it that I keep in the range bag or wherever handy to go shoot. And then last but not least, I keep this Grimlock for when I go to a class. I usually uh, keep that on there so I can it doesn't spill out everywhere. And I can also clip a, a Nalgene bottle on the side of here, usually if, it, if it's light, you know, if it's uh, getting empty so it doesn't blow away when I'm done with it or whatever. Um, in here, I just kind of use this as like a little, I don't know what you call it, a briefcase or something. I access little snivel gear throughout a class. Got some sunscreen, got some uh, Kleenex, uh, a couple of energy bars, batteries, Got some Surefire 123s, some extra 2032s, some triple A's, a whole packet of triple A's there. This is just loaded from the last couple classes I did. Some uh, business cards in there. Extra chapstick. What we got in there? That's a little lens cloth. Some uh, hand sanitizer, more sunblock, Kleenex, some lifesavers, <laughs> a little more Kleenex, some uh, more hand sanitizer and some contact uh, eye drops in case my eyes get dried out or something during the class. That's pretty much it. That's my look at my Eagle Range bag. I looked at the bottom of this thing. This thing has been, you know, used quite a bit. It's been to many, many classes and ranges and in the back of a lot of trucks. And I don't even see any pressure over it. Maybe a couple little bit of uh, fringing on the side, but man, this thing is, is so tough.